Hey guys, what's up? So today I'm going to show you guys how to change the version of iPhone apps and firmware. So today we're using Falza. The Wesley was a Falza uh, release 5 is 15 without a jailbreak, I believe. So you guys can use that. Um, it should work for this method as well. Um, so yeah, you also can get Falza from the Cydia if you guys have a uh, jailbreak. You guys can look up for yourself. Um, but for this video, changing the number, the version number of your iPhone iPhone applications isn't easy or something that uh, we want to do. Perhaps you would even ask yourself, why don't I, why don't I even know this tutorial came up in mind? But this can be an opportunity for some users to learn about their file system edit it. So you also need a, like, fun bots, iPhone bots, you need an iFile from Cydia. Um, they suggest getting an iFile or, you know, obviously files as a new alternative. It's the later, a more updated version. Uh, it works with later iOS versions because it's much easier to edit the files. So I'll really leave this uh, link down description. Uh, it's like a TED tutorial, but like I said, you also can follow along with the uh, video about to do right now. So obviously you want to open up Falza and you guys go in, uh, obviously you go to Cydia, install Falza, and it's a free tweak. Um, you, well, for I for Falza, you can activate it, but like you can just press done and it obviously, you know, you can bypass it without having to pay anything. So you want to head over to var, actually we're going to go to the plus. So what we're going to do is actually go back. So you know, let me get rid of this right here. All right. So I'm gonna go over here, var, and we'll go to do, 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 mobile. And then you guys wanna go over to containers, bundle. So for here, we're gonna go to temp application. All right, so we go to app group. All right, so you see these three folders per app. So if you go to here, uh, you know what? Let's go to plus. Let's go to the, uh, that's another way of doing it. Go to apps manager. So let's do chess, all right? Go to here and then we're going to go to back mobile bundle and we'll go to application and then bundle <coughs> Should be applications, but it doesn't want to come up. All right, so we'll do it this way. We'll go out of here, go to here, go to our app. We're right, gonna go to our app, go to the plus right here, and then okay, property. So sh should come up as bundle short version. ID hmm. here. So your version we can edit guys. Um so I'll also say like bundle short version string and bundle version. And you should go to edit that as well. So And you can also, guys, go to info plist and uh, pretty much do the same thing. So, version, metadata version. So, yeah, that as well. So, yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace.